hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome to today's video so we are at one of my favorite places in the world especially for home stuff we are at ikea so i thought i'd show you guys what's new in for 2023 talk through some home trends and just basically have a fun time at ikea they do so much stuff so much variety and they always have loads of new stuff at this time of year so let's head in and see what they got so the first thing I came across in Ikea was like a kids section with loads of art stuff. So I thought it was so cute for a playroom, a pegboard with a paper roll on, some art equipment, um, loads of paintbrushes, and then a stackable storage system, which looked really good. Um, some bright yellow colors, which is set to be a big trend for this year, is bold colors. Then onto the gaming section. How fun are these um, hands holding the headsets? Thought they were absolutely brilliant and definitely need to get them for the boys' bedroom along with the pegboards holding the remotes. So this is the Ekanabin shelving unit, which is the perfect neutral shelving unit. Looks so lovely and it's styled really nicely here. So Ikea have also used a rail for another storage method, which if you have the room is a really good idea. So some new vases and plant pots in Ikea. Completely adore this fluted kind of vase look. They had quite a lot of it actually in loads of different sections. Um, they always have so many plant pots and vases so you always can rely on Ikea for that for sure. So throughout this video you will see a lot of green and pink together. So green is set to be the biggest colour this year for interiors and i can totally see why so many different shades i'm a huge green fan and pink complements it perfectly so i think we can all agree that wood never really went anywhere but it's come back with a vengeance and this is the lister b side table love the curves how stunning so this is the Akena set range, which is new to Ikea. So it comes in this chair in three different colors, and then it also comes in a sofa. So the other colors are quite neutral, but this is a beautiful kind of ocean blue. Let me know what you think, or if you prefer the neutral colors. So Ikea genuinely had so many different cushions, but this is the Sonella in such a stunning coral color. For me, it's just screaming spring, summer. What a beautiful color. So this is the Scroovebe coffee table. Now, at first I wasn't too sure, but if you look at it on the website, they've actually styled it really lovely. And I feel like there was quite a lot of cottage style um, furniture in Ikea. So this is a product that if my house was done, would be coming home with me. This is a Vivella tablet or cookbook stand. It would look so lovely in a kitchen. As always, Ikea smashes it with their like miscellaneous decor. Um, some really lovely textured vases with, of course, my favorite eucalyptus. So this is the Norberg table and I thought it would be the perfect addition to a playroom simply because you can just flip it up and down. So when they're playing, um, have it tucked away. But when they want to do some drawing and some colouring, then get it out. I'm definitely going to get it for my playroom. So this is a Trones shoe storage slash storage unit. Really, really love this and thought it was such a good storage concept. So definitely want to think about for the new house. Really love this cottage kind of living room set up in Ikea. Of course, with hints of green, that beautiful sage green in the corner. Also featuring this new chair by Ikea, which is such... Um, a gorgeous tone of wood. I'm really into like my rich tones of wood at the moment and that's definitely going to be coming through I think as a big trend this year. Cannot go to Ikea without giving the best system some love. Now I've never actually used this system but every time I go in I just fall in love with it a little bit more. The versatility, um, so many different ways to use it loving the new shades especially this walnut color so yes yeah, something i really cannot wait to bring to life in the new house
so this is the bra shelving unit so it's not new but i always just think it looks so practical and i also really like the way they've um stored the tools with the pegboard something you can definitely do nicely in a garage or in like a workstation So keeping within the cottage style theme, I said I saw a lot around Ikea, um, they have a new dining set, which looks actually really good for like a small um, dining area or integrated within a kitchen. So this is the Atrusta uh, cleaning interior pullout um, for a cupboard. Oh, I feel like I really need this as well. I love the way it fits everything on, keeps everything organized. So definitely on the need to get list. So a new addition to the dining area. These are the new IKEA dining chairs and bench in a soft gray material. So this is an Iver storage unit in a really lovely sage green, obviously painted. But if you type Iver into the IKEA website, um, the way you can do this storage unit or these kind of storage items is literally endless. So definitely something to keep in mind if you're after a storage unit. It looks like you can fit loads in as well. So more new green in the kitchen accessory section. I'm not sure what you actually use these little green um, pots for, but you know, I like the color. So something you really don't expect to see at Ikea, an air purifying unit. So this was 55 pounds and I'd be really interested to see if anyone's used it and what they thought of it. So a new colorway in the Malm furniture. We have a light gray. I used to have so much Malm furniture in my old house and it was really good, a lot of storage and it's nice it now comes in different color. Some Pax Wardrobe Appreciation. Um, I can always appreciate a new Pax Wardrobe door style or colour. And then moving on to the new plaster style wardrobe door. So plaster have loads of different um, storage solutions, even beds at IKEA. But this is a new wardrobe unit for them. One thing Ikea do so well are kids' products and kids' interiors. How lovely is this under the sea themed bedroom? Um, a new colorway of the kids' storage at Ikea. Loads of kids' toys, also really reasonably priced. And they also had loads of baby stuff as well. Um, really cute looking and again, reasonably priced. Probably the smallest oven dish you will ever see, but I really like the colorways it came in and I would totally be tempted to try this. You can make little pies in it, thought it was really cute. So this chopping board system caught my eye, a bit different to your standard chopping board. However, when I went to fit in um, the unit in the picture underneath, it wouldn't quite fit. So I'm wondering if there's a different unit. However, I really like the concept. Then moving on to some new glasses in Ikea. So two pack for £10, um, a little bit different with a double lined glass more green with hints of pink so the psychology behind the color green is it's very calming it's very soothing it's obviously the color of nature and it's also said to be very optimistic as well so moving on into throw heaven at ikea there is a color and a type and a shade and a texture of throw to suit every person's taste and budget that's for sure 
So I then discovered something I've never realized at IKEA before, and that is a fact you can customize your own vanity unit. Now, when doing a bathroom, a vanity unit can be really costly. So this was really such a lovely way to kind of make what you like without um, breaking the budget could not resist this set of two baskets this is new in ikea and i think would complement any space perfectly so hanging on a unit hanging on a rail um hanging off a peg so lovely so the tating baskets for storage is something i'm definitely going to be using when it comes to my new home and then wow look at this magnetic kind of like chalkboard effect obviously it's not a real chalkboard because it's magnetic um but it has like a white chalkboard pen how good is this for meal planning and organizing i had to purchase this and then moving on to such lovely wash baskets ikea had lows but these were definitely my favorite such a wide range of lighting options in ikea i've never actually seen these wall lights before but i don't think they're new i just haven't been to ikea for ages I'm going to go downstairs into candle and plant heaven. So they had a couple of new candle scents, which were really lovely. So I had to purchase those. Loads of vases, just so much down there. Plant pots. And then, of course, to the um, real plant section. They didn't have loads, actually. Usually they have much more, but um, they definitely had some cute stuff. just admiring these plants in a jar then on my way out of ikea i could not believe how cheap the bistro was um, i didn't get anything but it all looked really really good but thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys soon